I hear we have some thunderstorms on the way. Dev, tell us what's going on. Sure, yeah, we do have some showers moving through for now, though. Got some cool cloud structures showing up on the sky cam this afternoon, and the radar is going to get a little bit busy later on tonight. Temperatures right now, we are in the mid to upper 70s across some of the region. Eagle River, you had some rain cooled air at 72 degrees, and Phillips is really cooled down into the upper 60s. Here's that radar, though. It's starting to get a little busy in our southern counties where there's even a flash flood watch hub. We'll talk about that in a little bit. I'm going to pan off a little bit through the west here where in Minnesota it's getting a little busy out there where there's even some severe thunderstorm warnings out because of some storms over there and throwing that radar into motion. It's kind of moving to a west, westerly to east direction right now, so it might clip our southern counties. We'll have to keep an eye on that to see if it makes it in our direction. That pink box you see is a severe thunderstorm watch. This is all part of a bigger system. It's currently set up shop. You can see you got this big little ridge here that's currently setting up shop. It's bringing in a lot of that of clouds and precipitation across our necks of, neck of the woods. Now we do have that flash flood watch up until 7 a.m. tomorrow morning, though. That is for Clark County and for parts of Adams County as well. Lots of heavy rainfall could occur in a short amount of time, so make sure to be prepared. We can see the rainfall chances coming over the next several hours. You can see why there's that chances of flash flood water or that flash flooding um, that's currently in effect. This is just one mile run. Many things could happen, but could see a decent amount of rain later on tonight through Wednesday with this one particular model run and even a slight risk of severe weather for the areas highlighted in yellow and then a marginal risk in the green area. So some of those storms could get a little on the loud side. We'll definitely keep you posted if some of those do get a little on the rough side. So your, so your future cast coming up again, the uh, precipitation will move through throughout tonight into early Tuesday morning. So don't be surprised to hear some thunderstorms overnight tonight. We'll keep you posted on that and then we'll catch a little break Tuesday before more precipitation develops in the afternoon hours on Tuesday. Your hour by hour forecast going through the next few hours though. Again, on and off chances of showers and thunderstorms possible. We'll drop into the mid 60s for lows and keep you posted on the latest with regards to any rain chances. We'll send it. We'll, we'll be back in a little bit.